my name is Gaurav Chaudhary and this is my YouTube channel. Uh, if you have not watched the previous video, this is related to a uh, uh, Tiger Analytics interview round one, uh, Python code, Python coding round. And the code is uh, I have called the first code. You can go and watch that. Now I'm moving to the second code, and this is the second day. If you don't want to watch the video entire video, you can just follow me here on LinkedIn. I have shared the uh, coding and how I call it. If you need an explanation, you can go and watch the video. Now this is the second question. You can follow me here. So let's get started. And the second question was very easy. It is not tricky one. Just they they wanted me to not use the uh, method. So Python method. I cannot use the Python method for this. So let's start it. And the question question uh, I'll just write it here. Question was. Text. So yeah, write a code. Write a code to get to get unique unique values from list. So this is the code. This is the problem statement we have, and I need to I need to get the uh, unique value from the list. So to solve that, we'll write a function because every interview want a uh, function. The reason is it is optimized and they understand how how much Python coding you understand. From that day, anal analysis. So, uh, if it is very small, uh, try to write it into a, a function only because it is always a good representation. So, as I mentioned, uh, when we uh, write a function, give us specific. So, we are finding here a, 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 a unique value. So, find unique unique value. Okay, and I'll I'll pass the list here as a variable, and after that, so we have passed the list. Now, what should we do? So we need to get a one list. So I'm going to store that into a unique list. So I'll assign unique, unique as a list. This is an empty list. After that, I'll use the for loop for num in LST. So I'm passing. Uh, I'm using the for, uh, forward loop here to pass a single, single, single variable. So after, after that, I'll check if num not not in unique. तो so, ये कोड क्या लिखा है मैं वो आपको एक्सप्लेन करता हूँ तो so, इस यूनिक लिस्ट में ये एम है तो ये नंबर यहाँ पे प्रेजेंट नहीं है इफ इट इज प्रेजेंट देन इट विल नॉट पुट ओवर वेयर तो लेट्स डू दैट नॉट इन माई यूनिक लिस्ट तो आफ्टर दैट इफ इट इज देयर देन इट विल नॉट अपेंट इफ इट इज नॉट देन इट विल अपेंट तो सो दैट मीन्स दिस इज एम टी लिस्ट तो देर इज नथिंग इफ आई एम पासिंग अ नंबर वन देन इट इट इज नॉट देयर देन इट विल अपेंट It is there. It will not happen. So I'll just write unique unique dot open. Okay, and we pass our num. So we just pass the num, appending the num over there. And after that, a return, a return, a return. Ah, uh, unique because we want that to be printed. Okay, so we are printing the. It is very simple. You can see now. I'll just pass the list over here. You can pass any kind of list. One, two, three, three, uh, eight, two, one, six, something like that. And I'll, if I pass that, you can see function object is not just stayed. Just ah uh, yeah. And if you give the parentheses over here, closing and opening, so that I'm passing the variable. Now you can see one, two, three, eight, six. Those are the variable I have. One. And if you you can say I I can use the list method here. So if I List not uh, state. If I pass the state over there, and if I pass this list, so I'll get the same same thing. Okay. So, let's see what we get. Yeah, I need to choose the open square bracket. So you can see I'm getting the same variable, but in the list dictionary form. I need it into a list, so I have used. And you cannot use the method. That's the why. That's why I'm not using the state state here. So this is how you solve this. And thank you for watching this video. Uh, make sure you subscribe to the channel. And this is this is second question asking uh, Tiger Analytics interview round one. And yeah, so thanks for watching this. Video.